Assalamu alaikum guys. Once again, I brought a bundle of mistakes in the construction of this RCC slip. So let's get started guys. You can see clearly in this RCC slip, you will find more than 50% lapping, lapping length. Guys, you can see clearly. This is beam on the top of this beam. You will see after 15 to 20 feet, you will see the lapping length. So guys, this is not the proper steel reinforcement placing in the construction of this slab. Look here guys. You can see this is beam. And you can see the overlapping. Where we required to resist negative bending moment. So on that place they are providing lapping length. So I don't know why. Look here guys. Everywhere you will just see lapping length in the construction of this slab. So this is the first slab construction of reinforcement which I am showing you. More than not 50%, more than 80% you will see the overlapping. Guys, you can see after 14, 15 or 14 to 18 feet, you will see the overlapping in the construction of this slab. Guys, they need to provide here extra steel rods are bent up bar. So everything is wrong. The spacing of look here guys this is the middle of this uh, residential building you can see so you can see the lapping which is about just two feet now here guys you can see this is the lapping spacing is not proper for main bars distribution bars actually these people don't have the steel structural design they don't have supervisor guys you can see the beam you can't see any development length. This is the junction between beam and column. There isn't any proper steel reinforcement details. So when you are doing the job without structural drawing or a side supervisor, so you will see these kind of mistakes in the construction of this lab. Guys, everywhere in this lab, you will just find the overlapping for main bars and distribution bars on the top of beam in the junction at the middle at L by 4 distance, L by 5 distance, so just overlapping. These steel rods are not scripted. Actually, these steel rods are cut by a steel fixer. I don't know uh, from where they brought this experience and they implement in this slab construction. Actually, on this construction site, at this time, uh, which I'm uh, actually I'm recording this video, there isn't anyone. So therefore, uh, if there is any uh, person, maybe contractor or maybe a project owner, so I will discuss with them. So if I see them, actually it's very hard here. So therefore, I can't see someone here on this project. So just uh, I'm showing you these kind of constructions. So you should avoid these kind of mistakes. Remember, guys, you can see the beam spacing of stirrups. It's still reinforcement. So everything is wrong. So this is a uh, lack of project. Lack of dollars they will invest on this project. But guys, you can see. Actually, the main thing is steel structural design. So if you don't have and you don't have any idea, so you should hire a structural engineer they, they will give you the structural drawing you should uh, provide uh, you, you should hire the a site supervisor to guide the steel fixer according to the drawing then you will not see this kind of bad job hope this video can help you thank you